Hey guys, what's going on? It is Talk Falls TV. Yes, I'm here with the Transfer News Daily. Um, bringing you all the latest news from the City Dram, giving all that real fan food, and just getting up to date with all things for us. Obviously, I'm going to be a little bit day late on the one new deal, as it said in the title. Um, obviously, a little bit busy yesterday, so I never got around to doing it. But, um, Frederick Wanu. The Bonday, um, Bombay goalkeeper, as I mean, um, Forest had a um, bid rejected from yesterday in the region of £1.8 million. And when it, it was two million euro, um, it was rejected. And obviously, it has been said today that we got to put in an extra million in for him, um, to sign the young goalkeeper. It has been said he is quite a prospect coming through at one day. He is the number two transfer at um in the Denmark team. It also been said that um lot of the prospects and a lot of people are highly rating him and that Bruno does want to leave move to a bit of lead where he can really push Michael to that um number one spot. It has been said that Forrest are interested in him. Um, it is said that we had that had that bid rejected for him, and it is saying today that Forest all we've got to do is put in that extra million in for him to actually sign him. Um, get your comments coming in on it. Obviously, we have got the live chat on. We have got everything on. So do get your comments coming in. Um, it has been said that Forest are looking for a goalkeeper. We have been awesome, but we've been unlucky, and now it's been said that. One O, the Bundy goalkeeper. It is being set up. We are after him. So hopefully, Forest do actually put in that extra million to bring him in. We are looking to strengthen that goalkeeping department. I can't see anything really challenging there for that first team spot. And obviously, if Wolverton does want to send Jimmy into the tough out on loan, and hopefully get some first team experience. So obviously, the team used to sat in a bit. Um, we are against Newcastle tonight. It will be quite only if Mark Wilton has spoke about transfers after the game like he has been. Um, other transfer news, Felios, obviously there's been a lot of spoken about Felios um, in this past couple of days. Obviously he's not getting no first team football whatsoever. He paid for the trick for his last night against Bristol City at the Impact Stadium. Uh, probably it is frustrating for him but I can't see Felios staying at the club. Um, I think we will let him go out and actually sign someone else if we're not going to feature him. Um, I think as well with Felios, I think if he does go and Tyler Walker does go out and loan to Notts County, I think that should be a loan to January. I think we need to strengthen that striker's um, department. I think we can't go into from August to January just with Cummings, Berriton, Murphy and... Jamie Ward and probably McKay up front. I think we do need strength in it and hopefully that we could, even if it's a loan for a Premiership striker, I'd be happy with that. So that's all the latest news that does is going off at Forest at the minute. Please get your comments coming in. Thank you for watching Talk Forest TV. Please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. And that's it. Thank you. Goodbye.